Hello and welcome to Candy's Ventures. This is my travel with me to the Sudan video. I am just displaying everything I'm taking with me so that I can get started on packing. But I travel tomorrow morning, so until then, let me just get started and we'll see each other in the morning. Oh goodness, look at that. Mm. This is the view from my balcony. It looks amazing. Damn. Look at the sun.
Okay, so now this is the food that I got on this flight. Specifically, I requested for chicken and rice because the other option I think was fish and rice or something else. I don't remember very well. And so they brought these and they brought like a snack bar. It's made of nuts and a lot of honey. This thing is so sweet. There was a biscuit or rather a cracker. I think that's American style. I don't know. They bring you a bun. So for starters. Um, just to cleanse your palate, I think. And there's always a small bowl of vegetables that I never eat. <laughs> and yeah, of course, then they give you some butter, whether unsalted or salted, whichever you prefer. Oh my God, I love this butter. You know, I've always avoided it. But the first time I ever ate it, I just never stop nowadays. I carry some home. Yeah. And of course, they give you a fork and knife and a savier in case you make a mess. Yeah, and basically, obviously, all of that has got to be halal. Yeah. Okay, now here's the thing about flying. Flying is fun, okay? But when the turbulence kicks in... You just wish you stayed back home. And then again, keep in mind that this was just a couple of months after the other Ethiopian airline aircraft crashed, just as it was leaving Ethiopia for Kenya. So it wasn't easy. It wasn't easy, guys. <laughs> 